The five customers every barber hates. Part one. The drug dealing steadhead chap. Oof! I would have every one of them. Easy. And especially him. Look, you don't want to get too pally with these deals, right? He's going to ring you late at night. And he's just going to appear randomly into the shop. If you're fully booked, he's going to be too intimidating to say no to. My advice is avoid at all costs. Give him a decent haircut. But that's it. The Karen. Big, big, big trouble. No matter what you do, there ain't no pleasing a the Karen. They're going to make you feel like dirt. She's actually alright looking. This doesn't make sense. There's no pleasing them. No matter what you do, they're going to ruin your day. Avoid them, don't entertain them. The Gypsy Traveller. Love them, hate them. My advice is be nice to these dudes. I'm going to fuck you up if you don't. Probably going to ask for a haircut that you don't usually do. It's probably not going to be too complicated, but my advice is be sound to these dudes. Or else Simon, you're gonna get fucked is up. you the thieves of rat python? I don't know. For all the rats up in the side of the living room, for the kids of open their trails. Kids with long hair. Now you gotta be technical with these. Hope that the mother and father say I'll be back in two minutes. Then you can butcher them. If not, you're gonna have to pretend to be a section guard. Spend 45 minutes. Probably won't get a tip. The smelly old man. You wanna love him, but you can't. You just can't. He probably stinks a piss. But the thing is, get him cooked quick. He's probably only paying six quid anyway. And then listen to his stories after. You might become mates with him. That's my advice on that one. Hey there, young fella. Bringing me good news today? And please subscribe to the Pissed Off Barber.